Hi, that's me, David Cox. Wait, no, that's me, on the right, holding the human brain. I'm an assistant professor of molecular and cellular biology and of computer science at Harvard University. We're launching MCB80.1x, the first section of a full course in introductory neuroscience, as an experiment in what online education can be. There are three key things that will be different about MCB80x. First, we'll try and take education out into the world to see things you couldn't easily see in a lecture hall. We're going to go around Harvard and Boston and beyond, to places where science is happening. The second key part of the course is a new model of interaction that we're calling Guided Interactivity. In MCB80X, we're working to bring this interaction model to the internet. We'll invite you to interact with rich simulations seamlessly woven into the flow of instruction. It's like a choose-your-own-adventure lecture. The third pillar of our course is do-it-yourself science. One of the most important elements of the internet today is participation. The internet enables mass creation and discussion on a global scale. Our partners at Backyard Brains have designed inexpensive hardware that allows you to perform easy neuroscience experiments in your own home. You can follow along with our experiments, but we'll also invite you to film your own efforts, including variants on the experiments that we perform in class, and we'll post the results for everyone to see. It's an experiment in large-scale participatory science. We're trying out new stuff, and we don't know which parts will work and which parts won't. Sometimes things won't work, but with your help, we'll figure out what's broken, what's not quite right, and we'll iterate. For now, since this is all still just an experiment, we focused on building just one small section, or module, from the full course. In this section, MCB80.1x, we'll explore the fundamental electrical inner workings of the neuron, which form the basis for neuronal signaling. We'll learn how the machinery of the neuronal cell membrane gives rise to an electrical potential, and how this electrical potential is used by cells to generate signals, and how these signals travel across your body, enabling you to perceive the world and act upon it. In future sections, we'll explore how groups of neurons work together to form networks, how much larger networks are organized to form the key subsystems of the brain, and in the final module, we'll explore neuroscience in the context of society, including questions about what intelligence is and what the future holds. Explore the MCB80X website and the content that's available to you. Join us. We hope it'll be an exciting educational experience.